Today we're going to talk about liquid line solenoid valves. It is a common component that is installed on your evaporator unit coolers. This is the component right here located on the inlet side of your evaporator before your expansion valve. The purpose of a liquid line solenoid is to pump down the system. It is a normally closed valve, which means when this coil is de-energized, the valve is closed. When we are in refrigeration, the, the coil is energized, opening the valve and allowing mass flow through the unit cooler. The purpose of the valve, like I said, is to pump the system down. So when the thermostat satisfies, it de-energizes the coil, shuts the valve, and allows mass flow to cease to go through the coil, going lower and lower pressures on the low side of the system, where your low pressure cutout on the condensing unit turns off your compressor. When sizing a liquid line solenoid valve, one common misconception is it is sized on connection size. What we need to understand is this valve requires a pressure drop to out open and close properly. This is done by mass flow. So just please know you should be not be sizing these on connection sizes versus mass flow capacity.